Hey, you want to go to Miami again? Yeah. All right. Oh, well, look at him turning. Uh, better shot. It was not that hard to turn. <laughs> hey, how's it going, guys? So this is going to be our vlog number six, or five and six. And we are going to go to Miami again because why not? We're going to go again. And this time we are going to get some pictures. Hopefully. Right now we're going to stop at Dunkin' Donuts real quick, get some coffee and uh, chocolate. Yes. It's right there. Oh, it's right there. Yes. Now to Miami. It is January 27th and we are here in Miami once again. Yeah. And we are going to maybe get some food real quick and then take some pictures of some cool stuff and us posing in front of the walls and try to look cool and stuff like that. Yeah, the food is great, now we're going to go check out some drones. Cool. Yeah. So we finally got back from Miami. It's been a long day. Now we're gonna just go ahead and we're gonna watch Netflix now. And here's our little setup. So we have a projector and we connect it to my laptop and we're able to point the projector straight up so we can lay down and just watch Netflix on our ceiling. We're lazy. <laughs> that was all Marissa's idea. It's very nice. <laughs> <laughs> Super exciting thing. Today is February 1st, 2018. And we are going to go to downtown Fort Myers and record a rapper. <laughs> Snap, guys. So that was crazy. Where is how you feeling? All right, I don't even know what's going on. Okay, so basically, rundown of what just happened. Literally, what just happened right now. Some guy gave us five dollars each. Like, show the five dollars. Dude, I don't even like, know why. Yeah, he gave us five dollars because he was in the club. Oh. He was in the club and he saw us like taking pictures and video, and we're like, we were confused. We're like, what's this for? 
He's like, because you guys were working. And I'm like, what the heck? So, best $5 ever. I'm like, what the heck? I wasn't, what the heck? So, that's cool. And then, basic rundown. We met the rapper, super cool dude. And then, on top of that, we met a bunch of DJs. All of them very cool. On top of that, I met a barber. And I'm going to get my haircut with him one day and kind of make, make a vlog about that. And on top of that, we met the the owner of the, the club and he needs people to take pictures and video for him. So we're like, yes, we would love to help you out. So this weekend, we're gonna go. So today is January, no, no, it's February 2nd technically because it's like one o'clock, what time is it? It's like 1.30 in the morning, all right? And I still gotta go. It's 1.44. <laughs> for my students out there. I still we have work tomorrow. Yeah, so <laughs> we get, Thursday. Yeah, so for my students out there, I gotta still go to school work tomorrow and give you guys a test. Pass that test. Anyway, <laughs> holy snap. It's just so <laughs> exciting. And we even met the we met the owner of the club and he has like all of these cameras and he actually invited us out to come out this weekend and take pictures for him too for the club. <laughs> and if he likes us, we're gonna be taking more pictures for him. This is I don't know what's happening, but something is happening. I don't know what's going crazy. on. Crazy. Like we're actually making money. Like we like we actually have like people who want to take pictures and videos for them. Like that's just it's, it's just mind boggling. It is February 2nd, 2018, and we are in downtown Fort Myers again. And we're going to the same club that we went yesterday to Celsius in downtown Fort Myers. Yes. Super excited, very nervous, never done this before. Uh, for those of you who don't know, it's extremely difficult to take pictures and video in the night life, the nightclub scene. You really gotta play around with your camera settings and just get really creative. So, let's see how it goes. We just finished recording for the club Nightlight for the first time. You have to enjoy yourself and capture the moment and that's really all it took. So, very cool. Met all the DJs and now we are gonna go to the office and edit everything we just took. Today is February 7th? Yeah. February 7th, 2018. And we are in downtown Fort Myers once again. Um, so right now we are going to meet up with someone that we met randomly. He has his own nonprofit and stuff like that, which basically allows uh, children that have their parents uh, incarcerated, so students that have, or kids that have their parents in jail, and he allow, and his organization allows them to communicate with each other uh, uh, through letters, I believe, and they're able to talk back and forth that way. So it's very cool, kind of gives them an opportunity to communicate even though the situation is not the most ideal. So we're gonna meet up with him and he's actually might be coming with us to, down, to Tampa uh, on the 13th, right? Yeah. On February 13th to go to see Gary Vee. So super cool. So we're gonna go have some coffee with him. Then after that, we are going to talk with the manager at Celsius Nightclub and see if we can work out a deal with him. Oh, it's a bad time. We just finished having a really awesome conversation with Antoine, the person that we met at uh, Celsius the other night. And I asked him if he could share some words of wisdom with uh, some of my students at Immokalee High School. And here is what he had to say. Yeah, um, I would try to keep it simple and just say, stay creative, always tap into your creativity. The older we get, the more we think that 
the youth in us is, is old. That youthness is what keeps us creative, keep us blossoming, keep us growing, and you can take it into any aspect of your life, from the, the way you can be creative about your relationships with people, to your business, to your to your hobbies. So um, stay creative and stay alive, stay vibrant. There's nothing wrong with being with being youthful in mind, body, and spirit. Awesome. All right. Thank you. Holy snap, guys. <laughs> so that was super cool. Um, so we just finished having our meeting with Antoine again. Literally met him in line at the pizza place in downtown Fort Myers. Had no idea that he did any of this and he took like a bunch of notes. So let me take a let me show you guys. So he took a bunch of notes on what he uh, needs and what he has ideas of and holy crap. Super, super excited. So now it is, let's take a look at the clock, eight o'clock. So in one hour, we're gonna talk to the manager of Celsius Nightclub and we need to make sure we're on the same page when we walk in there for that meeting because it's our first meeting ever like like this and we just want to make sure we're ready for it so how, how are you feeling or something? i feel so nervous <laughs> so nervous <laughs> <laughs> so we just finished our meeting with the manager at celsius nightclub and it went freaking awesome um so he's still gonna talk with the owner of the club and talk about uh, what they can do uh, as far as it goes budgeting. for budgeting, pricing, all that stuff. But uh, besides all that business talk, uh, we mentioned that we are going to go see Gary Vaynerchuk on Tuesday, February 13th. And bro, he knew he knew who he was. He knew Gary V. He knew Gary V. And he was. He's like, wait, what? He's like, what? We're like, you Gary guys know? Gonna be in Tampa? He's gonna be in Tampa. And we're like, yeah, we're gonna go. It's free. You should come. He's like, what the heck? He's like, we're like, what? Let's go. He was like so excited. I was cool. And we're like, what? We're bonding over a moment. <laughs> so, <laughs> we're bonding over Gary V. We're again. bonding over Gary V. Again, dude. Gary V. If you ever watch this. Thank you so much. Like, like because of you, we met so many cool people. <laughs> for real, like what the heck? So he might be coming with us to uh, Tampa. So right now we have three people coming all together. I know. <laughs> so it's gonna be crazy. <laughs> <laughs>